Record. Okay. Oh, <laughs> yeah, by JJ the mining guy, and uh, I forgot his name. The talent ninety five. My uh, name is Samuel. And Samuel, uh, I'm from the channel of JJ the mining guy, and he is from the channel of the SM cast. We are here today to start the pilot episode for a new series of videos that probably will never continue. But hey, it's called General Shit Weekly, so yeah, enjoy. Us ramble on about general shit for about the next. 30 minutes. Literalize. I mean, ge it is generalizing shit. Gen yeah, general Stuff shit. Stuff which comes out to your ass. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, moving along. Um, anything you've got to... Any topics interest you at the moment? At all? Any topics which interest me at the moment? To discuss. Or... Well, I mean... Call it... No, I, I, I can't. <laughs> I'm probably the worst socializer ever. <laughs> Okay, right. Um, I'll pick a topic for us. College course false advertising. <laughs> oh, I've no idea how I'm going to do this. I'm probably the most least social person uh, ever. It's going up unedited. So you get this all is going up juice. unedited. Yeah. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Um, the main reason we come up with college course false advertising is because before going into college, we thought that we'd be learning like cool stuff, like how to uh, how to actually program certain languages, making general cool stuff, making games, things like that. That's why they advertised it to me. They did not advertise work skills, um, business, um, writing more documents than you would if you were in an English A level. Uh, they didn't advertise any of that, and I think I mean, that is with me. I've probably done more work I've done in all my GCSEs in this past four to five months mm. in college. I, it sucks. It does oh. suck greatly. Uh, so I don't really think there's much we can cover about that. But basically, just college just sucks. Don't don't look forward to it. It's bad. Um, just pick the easy courses which can then get the UCAS points or grades which can then go to university which you may enjoy because I didn't do that but but do not pick RE because retardism um, art that's just no or business studies just none of them that's okay well not really because they don't most colleges and most universities don't even accept business studies oh I know so yeah, that's that's that topic. Um, have you seen Ubuntu phone? A what? Ubuntu phone, Linux I've, mobile. I've ne I never heard of one. Of them. A Linux. Yeah, it was announced at CES just just this last week. Um, it's quite cool. Uh, it's, it looks better than both Android and iOS. In fairness, iOS isn't particularly difficult, but you know. Um, it, it 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 just seems to function more fluidly and it's more See, now my... based. Um, so if you if you Google images of it, you should be able to see what I mean. It's got quite a nice UI as well. See, uh, now I know what you're gonna say when I say this, but I do have an Apple phone. Yeah, well, However, it's the three GS. I don't normally use my phone that much, and it just does all the basic shit I want to do. You no, know, it's not. It doesn't. Cook toast or melt chocolate. I don't want it to do that. Yeah, just no, no. Oh, silence. Just don't buy Apple in future. Anyway, moving along. Um, random shit we brought recently. I wrote down as one of the topics. Anything you brought randomly? Just general random shit. Random shit. Oh god, I did actually. I brought a fairy tale book on computer science. What? Yeah, so it so it goes into programming and uh, computa computation and um, in fairy tale form. Fair so that's quite interesting. Fairytale computer programming. Computer science. Computer science. Actually, rather interesting. I've just got up to binary. Binary surprisingly easy. Yeah. I know. Easy to learn. Okay. It is. Oops, Wait, easy. Zero zero one zero in decimal. One minute. What? Zero. Zero one zero. What? Why do you start with? Is this from the left or the right? Well, how would you think it goes, Norman? It goes from the left. 
normally binary starts with so one. First zero. Like, How much would that be? I need, look, look, I need paper to write it down. Look, it, binary goes in one, two, four, eight, sixteen. Hold on. Two, six, blah blah blah, and you only count for the ones which are one. B. And it works in the form of twitches, which is one is on yeah. and zero now, is off. It's just to generate to an argument. If you, if the first, if the fourth, let's go from. Let's go from the the stupid one to the right to left. If we go from the right to left, what's the fourth number value? If it what was the four, well, if we went from right to left, yeah. what's the fourth number value? So zero one zero zero. If it was one, that is. If the fourth number was one, what would it be worth? If the fourth number was one, from which side? Right to left. Yeah, that's how binary works. Right to left. Yes. And you think, uh, yeah, and one is... No, 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 no. Right. Write it from left to right and read it from right to left. Yeah, you yeah, you write it from left to right and then read it as in right... Yeah. 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 So is that what you're just trying to get to me, that whole thing? Question. What would 0010 zero, zero, be? I'm asking these questions. Yeah, I thought I was just came, you know, came here to record this casual chat. <laughs> and you're questioning me on my logic. Oh, Just wonderful! What cool. was a jolly little uh, happy-go-lucky um, recording has degenerated into a full-blown argument. So yeah, I've 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 searched his fairy tale computer science. Well, you found it. Yeah. It's Amazon. <laughs> I just Google images it. Ah. Oh. What's wrong with Amazon? No, 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 no. I just Google images. Google imaged that thing. Um, computer science with thingy. And do you know what came up? Christianity what? without fairy tales, when science and religion merge. <laughs> what? Really? Published book. That's it. That's just like a nice book. No, no. It's, it's called Computational Fairy Tales. Beautiful book. Beautiful. <laughs> Very interesting. I should be reading it right now, but I'm talking to you instead. Which. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah. Image. Yeah. Be quiet. Oh, okay. I see. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I guess that's kind of cool if you're twelve. If I'm twelve. What? It's interesting. Is it? Why? Why didn't you just get interesting? Yeah. It's got a cool, solid story to it. What? It's about this woman. What courses have you taken? What courses have I taken? Apart from IT, you've taken physics, correct? No, maths. Yeah, uh, I brought design media studies. Mm-hmm. Right, this is an I example of what you shouldn't do when picking A levels. Media studies. Okay, <laughs> yes, it's pretty Second. shit, but the course uh, I want to do at university only depends on. You cast point. So therefore, if I get more UCAS points, I can do the course. And therefore, media studies is actually quite a popular and wanted course by universities. Quoted from teacher. Yes, I think nobody wanted to go on that course, so they lied about it, so more people would. No, no, we were told that when we joined the course. See, if, if we were told that it was a shitty course, <laughs> it tries to be an easy course. They found out that it was a shitty course. I don't know, though. You don't know? No, I think it might be just a shit course that you'd pick. <laughs> Come on, Jack. Go about your course, then. <laughs> my, no, my course is awful. Um, but, man. My course is a B-Tech course. Oh, 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 oh. Be quiet. B-Tech course. It's worth loads of UCAS points, but it's shit. How many, how many UCAS points is it worth? Uh, it's like three and a half A-levels, essentially. I think uh, it's an A star is worth 140, and then it goes down from that, doesn't it? Yeah. Um, By 20 points each turn. Okay. Well, we, we've we've successfully covered that topic for long enough. Um, <laughs> yeah, no, we went to for nine minutes. We went, back to, uh, we, we went from... I don't know, I can't remember. We went Phone. from, what was it, courses, binary, and then back oh. into courses, and then went jit. I don't know, it's weird. Moving along. This is a great pilot episode, by the way. Um, hope you're all enjoying it, all five of you that might be watching. <laughs> uh, yeah, all five of you and the two people who liked it. <laughs> uh, uh, Steambox, what's your opinion? 
on the like nope. piston things. Steam I have box? No. You don't know what the Steam box is? Nope. You're an IT student. I have I'm not heard of that. What the? Steam box? I'll, I'll, I'll Google it now. I'd... Steam box. I can hear you typing. Which Ooh, I see. Yeah. It looks like. It's basically okay. Steam's console. It's just kind of. That runs. Fell. It, it's not. It's quite powerful. The piston, which is supposedly coming out, which was announced at CES, is not anywhere near as powerful as your computer, but it's still pretty damn powerful for what this, it is. It's essentially the size of your mouse. Um. You know, Razer just brought out like first gaming tablet. Razer, yeah, I know. I'm not, I'm not all that impressed, to be fair. I'm not impressed by it. I haven't seen the specifications yet for it. It looks, it's, it's good, like on specs, but it's just not great. Um, but something that did interest me was the Nvidia Shield, which alert, enables you if you've got an Nvidia graphics card, like 660 Ti or above, mm. to stream, like over Wi-Fi your game to this device so you can play pc games as long as you've got a wi-fi connection i believe i think it's any wi-fi connection that's quick enough to accommodate um uncompressed 720p footage from your home computer to the device yeah um you've got also got a response time back as well so yeah that sounds kind of cool and it's like portable pc gaming but you have a very limited controller, and I don't know how... I don't know. It, it seems gimmicky. Not like Kinect, I still don't... Gimmicky, but more so than Wii. Um, Dear God. Yeah. I've just seen the price for that. Uh, do you know the Razer gaming tablet? How much is it? It's like $1,300. <laughs> no. Yeah. I'd, I'd rather <laughs> the um, Razer Blade, that Razer Blade laptop thing. Oh, the, the laptop, that, that looks alright. Yeah, that's actually insanely powerful, considering it's like the same size as a MacBook Pro. It's just mm. nuts. And it looks actually nicer than the MacBook Pro, got to admit. Um, I thought you hated Razer and Jack. Well, some of their products have been known to be a bit shoddy, um, so I avoid them. But they're, they're more expensive stuff, like um, their laptops and some of their higher-end keyboards have got really great reviews. It's basically their cheaper stuff, which is my end of the market. So, yeah. Um, yeah. What I think that's about it for today. Would you say? It's been on 12 minutes, like... moron. 12 minutes? Yeah. That's nothing to it. No. 12 minutes is good. We don't want to give them any more. <laughs> God. Um, so you're supposed to give it a bit of taste of the cookie. No, no. And then, no, no. and then when they've tasted it, it'll warm up. Full blown thirty minute lips. Right, let's have let's have a little gander. Right, thirty on minutes. The news website. Just see if there's anything completely useless and pointless going on. That's something that I've got written down. Just just have a little little work round. I was on here the other day and I found that someone had been run over by a uh, spack chariot. Shit! What? Made me laugh quite a lot. And the <laughs> person that got hit by the spack chariot was um, asking for the form of the spack chariot at laws. <laughs> <laughs> we cannot put this on the internet. Where's the spack chariot? You don't know what a spack chariot is. <laughs> you, do. <laughs> you don't know what one is. <laughs> Basically, just a grand bill. Um. <laughs> what the hell is even this? This is random stuff. The shitty cars just came up, like mi like <laughs> minis. You know? <laughs> do you know the land speeder of Star Wars? That just came up. What is this actually? It's like, um, you know, ah, oh, oh, god damn it. Um, you know, a granny mobile. A shop mobility scooter. <laughs> Someone got. Short spat chariots. <laughs> <laughs> I've just typed in spat chariot <laughs> and a land speed of Star Wars just came up. It's like, oh, and a Robin Reliant and a little load of shit for that. Shop mobility scooter, yeah. Uh... So someone got run over by one of those at 20 mile an hour. Didn't notice that he'd hit a child. 
continue going on. How old was the child? I, I'm not sure. I'll, I'll Google it on the BBC website and put a link in the description. Oh, see, we're professional. <laughs> After calling, a we give you the exact a spat share. Wonderful. Um, oh, shop mobility. <laughs> Twenty miles per hour. Per hour. I'll send you the link in a what? second. Hang on. Uh, mobility scooter test. Here we are. Um. Da, 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 da. Hmm. Shop mobility scooter. Done. Hey. There we are. Mobility scooter victims to visit Downing Street. There we are. Found it. Okay. Um, oh shit. Control C. Control V. There you are. There is the shop mobility scooter. Send him. Um, I have sent it. Shop mobility scooter incident. Mrs. Jefferson's nine-year-old son Isaac was hit by a mobility scooter in October. Isaac was on the pavement at the time. He was thrown against a shop window and fell to the floor. He was left shocked and bruised. <gasps> Shock horror! Holy shit! <laughs> Mrs. Jefferson reported the incident to the police, who was told they did not have powers to take action. Police officer said he had been hit by one himself on a cycle path, and he was off. When he was off, and he was off work for three months, she said. He said he agreed with me that something should be done. Inspector Ben, G oh yeah, this just gets boring. Basically, three thousand people think that mobility scooter drivers should take a proficiency test. I don't know whether or not this will take into account the girth of the people on the mobility scooters, because whilst a mobility scooter with a regular sized person on it will only take up like. A little bit of the pavement. It's still a nuisance, but it'll only take up a little bit. Some people that use mobility scooters will take up like the entire pavement. I've seen people, you know, when, when you're just walking up town, they come zooming past you. Yeah. You know, you put your foot out in the wrong way, and this old 90 year old fat dude just runs over your foot. And it's, it's like, basically. <laughs> Basically, hit and run. This this person hit and run, hit and run a young child while yeah. on the pavement. Yeah. I, I I don't see why why, why they wasn't arrested in any sense. Shop mobility scooter, monster mobility scooter, spat chariot, and run down this poor innocent bystander. It's just it's just wrong. Something needs to be done. On the other hand, why is this? On the news, because it's funny. Yeah, I know it's funny, but that shouldn't that doesn't give it the right to be on the news. Of course it does. Um, let's, let's look at the world. It's, it's got to be a media site. Anything funny like this has got to be in the news. I mean, yeah, I just look down and I just see some nasty ass shit, like it's people being killed and dying, and cancer and all that crap. And then you got to have something to lighten it up. Yeah, but. <laughs> so someone getting run over by a <laughs> chariot. Yeah, but it's need. funny because they didn't die, <laughs> and they got hurt, and <laughs> it's you know it's this ninety-year-old you know woman who crazily runs over small children on her stupid four-wheeled shitty so mo wheel. What you're saying is, after going on the BBC News website, you should immediately go to the Sun. And have a good laugh at all the retarded things that they spew out. Let's actually oh. have a look at the sun, see what... Right, let's... Latest news. Ender... En Ender's Gemma beaten to death by stoner bro after sink row. Um... I... 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 My... I let's get off the titty titty okay. page. There's tits everywhere. It's like okay. tits, 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 tits... I thought this was a news thing. Just... This is a person holding someone's tits on a website. <laughs> Put in groping performance at Golden Globe. And more boobs. I couldn't abort my disabled baby after seeing my 3D scan. Jesus Christ, I hate this planet. I really do. I really, really do. Why? 
Just... What? You hate this planet? Move to another one. Yeah, move. plan to move to Mars. <laughs> Uranus! Oh. 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 That's a good joke, isn't it? Oh, so funny. <laughs> right, oh, I'm yeah. the Sun's website because it's just terrible. Um, oh, I couldn't have bought my b disabled baby after seeing my 3D scan. What? I think we should just talk about another topic. Oh, Facebook and the frickin' retardism that is. Have you found anything of use on Facebook you know, in the last, like, six uh, months? Easy communication, which is free, but that's about it. Okay. But, I mean... I... It's provided by another service. The only good reason why people actually use Facebook is because people have... People have arguments on it, and it's just funny to watch. And then you can do funny responses in these arguments. And then if they go, why the fuck are you commenting on my status? Then you can just say, fucking keep it private then. Because oh. it's like two people have an argument. Why don't they just text or say in the actual fucking face? Oh. Just not have an argument. There's always that. Yeah. I just that. deleted my Facebook account, so that's why I brought it up. Uh, well, that oh. was a short topic. Uh, what else could we talk about? Magic the Gathering. Magic the Gathering. I have absolutely no knowledge of Magic the Gathering apart from the fact that the cards look cool. So cards pretty cool. It would be a very short. The. Oh. Um. Okay. Right. I've just got another thing to talk about Facebook, and it's just happened now. Random foreign people fucking adding me on Facebook. <laughs> I've just had this Polish person add me on Facebook. What's his Why? name? You Seth Jezaf. Okay, that's weird. I don't I don't know that person. No, I've just been getting like random Indian people and shit like that, and it's just a picture of Dave. Well, I'm glad I removed Facebook. Um have we talked about how retarded consoles are? Consoles. No, I don't think we've gone through that yet. Do you know we're basically going through all our options so we'll have no future material to talk about no, when no, we this is just this is just today's videos. This is just today's stuff. This will be our last topic. Right. Consoles. If you buy a console now... Last topic. This is our last topic. Yeah, this is our last topic. If you buy a console now, you're paying £150 worth of monies. Yeah, that doesn't make sense. <laughs> monies. Anyway, for like the equivalent of a freaking iPod Touch worth of electronics. Hmm. Why? Um... If you on an average PC, and it buy my thinking nobody should have laptops because they're just awful um <laughs> I did have a um, anyone that's got like an average pc that's been bought because most of the people that are likely to buy consoles will break their computer every couple of years anyway they're likely to have a newish computer averageish computer if you spend that 150 quid on a graphics card that you would have spent on an xbox then you've got a decent gaming rig, essentially. Well, it's, I not, guess. it's not great, but it's going to do better than like an Xbox by mm. like a couple times, due to the fact that an Xbox and PS3 both output Battlefield 3 at very low resolution. I think it's like less than 720p. Um, don't have anti-aliasing. Don't have antis an antroscopic filters.